The date of May 25 has a double evocative power in which the continent celebrates Africa Day, which marks the anniversary of the signing of the OAU, Organization of African Unity Agreements, which evolved into the present-day African Union, AU. Mosafaki Mahmed said for the past 10 years, Africa has been confronting with the challenges of terrorism, violence, extremism, and transnational crime, human trafficking, drug trafficking, arms trafficking. He said many states devote a good part of their resources and energies to fighting or protecting themselves against this phenomenon, thus depriving vital sectors such as health and education of the resources they need. He highlighted that the continent is also faced with the disasters generated by bad governance which can no longer be concealed by the demand for transparency imposed by a population that is increasingly open to the world through the new information and communication technologies. According to his speech, there is the economic crisis burden by the debt, the climate and energy crisis, which in turn affect food prices through the exorbitant costs of transport, while the health crisis following the outbreak of COVID-19 and weakens the population capacities of the various economic agents. Recently, Africa has become the collateral victim of a distant conflict between Russia and Ukraine by profoundly upsetting the fragile global geopolitical and geostrategic balance. It has also cast a harsh light on the structural fragility. Musa said the AU Commission has also worked to address as far as its resources allowed concerns about health, education, infrastructure, energy, science and research, the sectors whose promotion and realization are necessary conditions for the development of Africa. He concluded that the results have not always matched our ambition, but we are on the right path from the focus pooling of all our energies and geopolitically dispersed resources will emerge a new Africa. The Africa we want.